thingy 1118. This is how to change protocol on the Kentex Synchro. This is specific to the Series 8000. I can't guarantee it's going to work on any other Kentex panels. So currently I've got one Apollo XP95 device connected to the loop. Before changing protocol, you probably want to disconnect the loop um, because I've been told the Cheeky, for example, have a higher operating voltage uh, on their loop. So you might want to disconnect your loop in case changing protocol could put a higher voltage through Apollo devices if they're still on the loop. Um, I've not personally had an issue with that, but probably safe to disconnect the loop if you're changing protocols. You don't have the wrong device on the wrong protocol or the loop. You're just asking for trouble. Um, right, so let's get started changing the protocol. So, zoom into the panel here. First things first to kind of identify what protocol you're currently running. That's best done by restarting the panel. You can see it's running an Apollo protocol. It's been going so long, battery fault was fine. So now we know it's Apollo protocol, let's show you how to change the protocol. Open the panel. You're going to want to turn on right enable. So we can change your config. So you're going to want to hold down silence alarm acknowledge function. And then you want to go press in this reset button. Continue holding that down. Right. Now we've got the option to go a new menu. Set memory right enable on, then press 1 to select the cheeky, press 2 to select Apollo. Because we've already got memory right enabled, which was turned on in the first place, that's fine. Memory right's already on. Again, you need this memory right to ensure any changes are actually saved uh, into memory on the panel, otherwise they'll, they'll be lost. Now, to change 1 and 2 here, this is referring to this arrow key system over here, 1 being at the top to be the uh, side here. Now I'm not going to change that because it's already a follow protocol which I need um, and I'd want to disconnect that loop first just in case there's a voltage uh, voltage difference there or any incompatibility that could cause devices to uh, malfunction having them connected on a loop with the wrong protocol. Um, but again that's just something I've heard um, about the operating voltages so just something to be aware of, it's just advice um, but it seems to make sense. Um, but that is how you change protocol on this panel. Um, I've been, it was kind of I was told by a few people you couldn't do it on these uh, synchro panels, you need different um, zone cards and different uh, loop cards. But uh, in the end, I, uh, I contacted uh, someone directly and got uh, the direct uh, information. So for this series, that is how you change the protocol. But you might find other synchros aren't the new 8000 series or newer. You can't change protocol. So uh, don't assume any Kentex synchro can change protocol. So thanks for watching.